Hello students, welcoming you all for today's session. I am Jyotsna from Chitkara School of Hospitality and in today's session we will be understanding about the uniform designing. So the objective of the session is at the end of the session you all will be able to understand how to design the uniforms for the hotel staff, what color combination should be kept in mind and what kind of fabric should be chosen. For the introduction part, what is a uniform if I ask you? So a uniform can be any of the outfit or the dress which is given to the staff who are working in the hotels so that they are comfortable by performing the task, various services and duties, responsibilities in the hotel. The uniform which needs to be chosen should be chosen in, in keeping in mind the designation of the staff and the department so that there can be the identification for them also. Let's move to the departments. The very first department is the housekeeping department. As the GSAs in the housekeeping departments have to do stretching, bending, they have to clean all the rooms, they have to make the rooms, beds, cleaning the entire floor and lots of heavy tasks. For this, the uniform which can be given to them, male or female both, can be a long shirt which can be till the length of the thighs. For the sleeve part, it can be a half sleeve or it can be a three-fourth sleeve which can be chosen. For the neck part, either a Chinese collar can be taken or a normal regular collar or a V neck can be chosen which can be now combined with the trouser and the very comfortable shoes. Next, if you have to design the uniform for the supervisors in housekeeping department or the HOD, male and female, a shirt can be given along with the trouser and a blazer again with the comfortable shoes. The next department is the front office department. This department is the face of the hotel and which come in the contact with the guest for most of the time. Thus, the uniform which needs to be given or which will be designed for the staff has to be eye appealing. For this, various options we have. For example, you can give a traditional sari for the receptionist or the reception counter. Either you can also give a blazer, shirt, a trouser, or a knee length skirt can also be given. If it is a male, a blazer along with a shirt, trouser and a tie or a pocket scarf can be given. Both can be given a comfortable shoes. The next department is food and beverage service department. As this department is responsible for the service part of the food and beverage to the guest at various outlets or various areas, there we can give the uniform which, with which they are comfortable. So for the male and the female, you can give a shirt, a trouser with an apron with pockets and the comfortable shoes. If you do not want to give the apron, it can be replaced with a waistcoat with maximum of the pockets. Or you can combine the waistcoat and the apron together in a uniform plus the comfortable shoes. The next very important department is the food and beverage production, which is the kitchen departments. This department is responsible for the production part of various dishes, menu items, beverage and food items in the hotel. So these are basically the chefs where you can give a chef coat with the trouser, an apron, chef cap and a chef tie. Different designs are possible as you can see in the image also for the chef cap plus different color combinations and button patterns are also possible. You have to provide maximum pockets on the sleeves and maximum pockets in the apron so that they can keep their extra tools and equipment for example the spoon or knives along with them. In this picture, we can see that other color combinations and designs are also possible. As for the trouser, you can take a black trouser or you can also go for the black and white check also. This can be same for the male and female both. The next department is bellboy. 
Bellboy is responsible for, he escorts the guests and helps them with the handling of the luggage either from the lobby to the, area, to the rooms or from the guest rooms to the lobby area. In this, we can provide a full one-piece jacket with a Chinese collar and a trouser with again comfortable shoes. Different design button patterns can be chosen. Next is the restaurant hostess. Restaurant hostess basically or generally it is a female which is staffed and positioned for these specialty restaurant. Based on the theme of the restaurant, the uniform can be chosen. For example, if it's a Chinese restaurant, you can give a full length dress which is also called as kimono for the hostess. If it's an Indian or South Indian specialty restaurant, a professional silk sari can also be chosen. Or if it's based on any other theme, we have other options also. Some of the hotels where you have a host, other designs for the waistcoat, trouser, maybe a kurta, a shirt or a trouser are available. Plus the comfortable shoes. The next very important department is the maintenance or the engineering department. This department is responsible for maintaining the entire electrical equipment inside the hotel. For this, either male or the female, we can give an overall coat which is called as dangri. It has maximum of the pockets on the sleeves, on the knees and at the waist also for storing and keeping other equipments. Apart from the dangri, you can give a trouser and a full covered close neck jacket also. Some of the hotel also prefer to give a safety cap and gum boots, safety boots. Next is the security department, which again plays a very important role in the hotel. For this, as this department have to stand outside in the periphery of the hotel premises, you can give a shirt, either half sleeves or full sleeves can be chosen, with a trouser, comfortable shoes, and a cap or a hat can be chosen as an option. This, if you can see, this gives you the recommended uniform fabric for different departments and different designs and different styles of the uniform. It has the preferred fabric which can be used. For example, if you are using shirt, it can be a cotton shirt, pure cotton, or you can also go for the blend. For the trouser, either polycot or any other different blend can also be chosen. This was all from my side. Thank you so much. If you have any queries, be in touch with me. Thank you. Yes, Kaduna, I.